Vlogger Day 285. Happy St. Patrick's Day, you drunks. Good morning. It's Friday, which means it's time for French Friday. I need to, I need to go get my portrait painted though. So let's talk on the way. There are a number of things about the metro system that are good and a number of things that are kind of annoying. So the good is that you really don't see it. You can feel it rumbling beneath your feet, but outside of a couple of lines that go over land, this one will, I'm assuming, as soon as we get outside of Paris, this one will come back up above ground, but in the city, most of them aren't, which is really nice. They're regular, like every few minutes you've got another train. They're direct, more or less. It's easy to get across town. Some of the unsung benefits would be being able to catch diseases, whether through what you touch or who's breathing around you. <coughs> getting to listen in on conversations. Like right now, people are getting to listen to me, so that's, I'm sure, really pleasant. There's crowding, there's interesting smells, strange liquids that you may or may not be forced to walk through, and of course, turnstiles that don't turn at the right time and smack you right in the leg. Needless to say, there's some quirk. So I'm in one of the suburbs of Paris. Suburbs in France are different than in the United States. The, I can't talk right now. I'm here to get painted. And I think this is, I think this is where I'm supposed to be going. So my friend Kelsey is an artist and she's going, she needs, she's going to paint me, not on me. Paint me, though, like a portrait. Like one of those French girls. Good girl. How are you? Good, how are you doing? Good. So this is, this is Kelsey. Do you want to explain what we're about to do? Uh, I'm going to paint him, and he's going to sit for me for three hours while I stare at his face <laughs> and put paint on a canvas. So. I was the best she could do on <laughs> short notice. things that I haven't uh, shown, I did take video of it, is the pigeons that wake me up every morning at about, between five and six every morning, the pigeons just decide to go nuts for about 30 minutes. I don't know why. Didn't get quite as much sleep as I would have wanted, so my brain's not, I, not really firing on all cylinders yet. It'll, eventually, it'll start work. It'll start to work again. Should do the line work. Taking our first break. Ah, stretch. We can see what, what we're looking like so far. Ooh, I like it actually. It's like a ghost picture. It's a ghost version of me. Yeah. I've got a little bit of a pirate skeletal look on the side there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, burn victim J. It's good. <laughs> I like it. No, it's looking good. I recognize myself in it already. Number two, we've moved from brown shadowy ghost, ooh, to colorful shadowy ghost. break before we go into our last session. It's looking good. If I do say so myself. We'll see how the rest of it goes. Yeah. I like it. It's on there, you'll see it. <laughs> well, that was fun. I've never been painted before, so uh, see what it looks like when it dries. She, this is echoing here. She said she might want to add some more layers to it later. Add some more detail, make it look even cooler. So we'll have to see what ends up happening. Boy. With all that, it is a beautiful day out here. 
I definitely am gonna need sunglasses. Whew. This is all one underground train station. It's one of the big ones, but it's all one station. You could do all your shopping here if you wanted to. You could buy shirts, you could buy more shirts for smaller people and Velcro shoes. You can even do your grocery shopping. You could basically live in this train station. Something else you want to watch out for. That's the control. The control will stop you. Check your ticket. And if you don't have one, or you didn't validate it, they'll find you. <laughs> A lot. So be careful. Yeah. 